Hello, today in this video I'll showcase how to update your locally hosted Minecraft server to the newest version, or at least just switch out the server jar in general. Now, for this video I'll be using Squid Servers as I find the management of the server super easy in here. So the first thing you're going to want to do is just close your locally hosted server. And now I'm going to go over here to my web browser and just download the latest jar. And I will link other web pages where you can download for your specific loader, say you're on paper or fabric. I'll link everything down below in the description that at least Squid Server supports. But for this video, I'm just going to do a vanilla server. So I'm just going to click download for the latest vanilla server here. Uh, save it wherever you like. And now we're going to want to go to where our server files are locally hosted. So in Squid Servers, all you have to do is just open up this dashboard and then click server files. Boom, I'll bring you here. And we're going to replace this server jar here. Now, what we're actually going to want to do first is create a backup. And Squid Servers, all you have to do is click this create backup button. But if, you de if you're not using a management panel, just go ahead and take a zip of all this just in case the changes over break something. It's just good practice. All right, now that the backup's been saved here, I'm going to go back to my web browser. I'm going to open back up where this server jar came from. And I'm going to open up the ones of our local files on the server. And I'm just going to drag it over here. And I'm going to replace the file name. You want to make sure the file name's identical. So yes, you do want to replace it. And you want to keep this as server.jar. This is very important for Squid servers at least. And now that we've done that, I'm just going to click start up on the server here. Wait for this to start. All right, now server started up. Everything says public, looks good to go. Let me go back to the Minecraft launcher, refresh, and nice, it's on the latest version now. All right, I've loaded into the world. If this video helped you out, please consider leaving a like and subscribing. It really helps out our small dev team. And I'd like to thank the community for the support on Squid Server so far. It's been overwhelming. It's been great. Thank you all so much and have a great day.